Yeah, lass, that's gorgeous. Gio, that's right good, that is. Chuffing hell. As you may know, I'm born and bred in Yorkshire. People say I've got a Yorkshire accent. I've never properly thought it, but actually when I think about it, chuffing hell, I have. So here's more about the Yorkshire accent and how you can also win lots of Yorkshire loveliness. So, let's go. Hey everyone. Now, a lot of people either say I look like Mylene Class or I'm like that woman off the Boddington's advert. So for those of you who don't remember or who aren't in the UK, Basically, I think it was Melanie Sykes and she's there supping a pint and then she comes out with a really regional accent um, which you don't expect and apparently that's what I'm like. So I found like the most amazing giftware. The, I was sent this as a gift but my mum originally got me an Airlast That's Gorgeous mug which introduced me to Dilectable and they have the best goodies which I'm actually giving away on my social media. But if you want to hear what the Yorkshire accent is like, this is it. So they've sent me this. I'll do a little unboxing. I'd love to know what your favourite accent is. I've got Airlast, that's gorgeous. That basically mean, means, I was going to say, basically means a up last, that's gorgeous. Um, it basically means... Um, you're lovely, you look gorgeous, you look beautiful, you are beautiful. I don't even know to translate from Yorkshire to normal language. Yorkshire, we have a very special language, um, but it's supposed to be one of the most friendly, so that's why, that's why I love it so much. Pure Yorkshire loveliness, I love this. Then we've got a Yorkshire goddess. And we say stuff like uh, Chuffinel, like uh, Blumenek. Oh, I can't swear, can I? Chuffinel, to translate it, um, like effing L, basically. Um, but it just sounds a lot more friendly, doesn't it? And Gio, give over. Or we've got, that's rate right, good. I say that a lot. That's rate right, good. Or it be rate. Right, or don't worry, just have a cuppa. Literally, anything could be happening. If you have a cup of tea, everything will be okay. Then we've got another little bag. Air last, that's gorgeous. Now, I love this because I'm all about self-care and positive affirmations. And sometimes we need to remind ourselves, don't we, that we are gorgeous, even with this accent. Also, this is the mug I have. Air last, that's gorgeous. And I love that mug. So just to remind yourself, you are beautiful or gorgeous. You're a gorgeous lass. Then we've got... Ooh, an air lass that's gorgeous compact mirror. I love that. I'd love to know what you think of the Yorkshire accent as well. You'll have to chat to me at Mama May blog. Because unfortunately, when I'm not doing videos, you don't get this Yorkshire loveliness. <laughs> I actually used to really hate my accent, especially when I was working in London in journalism. And it just felt like it stood out. Even when I was trying to turn it down, it would get worse. And nowadays, when I get tired, stressed, um, happy, excited, or around old friends, I get more and more Yorkshire. Got a goddess cup. I love that. That's great for the kids. Because I've got two Yorkshire goddesses, as you know, or divas, Yorkshire divas. Gorgeous girl. I love these. And now, if you want to, I can tell you what and help you hear the sound of the Yorkshire dialect. But if you want eau de Yorkshire, you want the smell of Yorkshire, this is it. It's a scented candle. Soy wax, cotton wick, 20 hour burn time, hand pour, poured in Yorkshire. Look, soy wax, we're now taking out and proper vegan friendly. Country garden. Ooh, it's lovely. Because often when people think of Yorkshire, they think of all the fields and the country gardens, which is true. 
but I live in a, a small house with a like brick terrace. <laughs> but the best of Yorkshire, especially where I grew up in Sheffield, there were fields and fields. I lived next to a graveyard, but when you live out on the outskirts, there's lots of fields to go to. Uh, last that's gorgeous. Gorgeous girl. Hot chick. So if you want to win this, make sure you follow me at Mama May blog on all my social medias. And I'd love to know what you think of the Yorkshire accent, but be kind because we are very friendly, but we're very sensitive about our accent in Yorkshire. Um, and I'd love to know if you think I have got a strong accent or not. I know Daria, who's filming it, my best friend, is probably thinking, yes. <laughs> Whereas I can't always hear it. I can hear it when I'm saying these things, but I can't always hear it. And people go, you're proper Yorkshire. But then in parts of Yorkshire, maybe it's because of where I grew up in the outskirts of Sheffield in a kind of roughish suburb, which I love. It was the mecking of me. Um, I'm, I was known as the posh girl. So this is actually a posh Yorkshire, Yorkshire accent, apparently. So yeah. And if you haven't already, check out the Boddington's advert. I think Yorkshire tea needs me. That must be Yorkshire tea at the door. Great, that's it from me. And I will see you there soon. Peace, love and lots of shimmies all the way from Yorkshire with lots of love. In fact, I've even got a card from Dialectable from Yorkshire with love. <laughs> Bye.